So I wanted to get your thoughts on what it's like to explore video game when it comes to voice acting versus traditional animated work. Yeah, it's funny with, um, you know, generally with acting, right, with perhaps being in a play, a movie, an animated series, you read the whole story, right? You have a whole sense of the arc of a character, where the adventure is taking you, beginning, middle, and end, um, by reading a script. But with video games, it's impossible to read an entire script as an actor and it's not offered so it's a really wild adventure in trust imagination and cold reading so I can show up to a session sometimes I'll get my lines ahead of time and, and have a chance to take a look a lot of times I don't so I have to just show up and know that they'll take me wherever they need me to go I'll show up with the voice that I know if it's a character I'm, I'm having the honor of reprising um, I will show up as Silver Banshee and I will let them direct me at their at their whim so uh, very little context is often given on the page so it's incumbent upon the voice director and the developers to offer context just enough to get me to the next line when it so. comes to a lot of comic book characters uh, especially in the DC universe a lot of these characters are dark in general but Lego always takes a tongue-in-cheek humorous approach so what's that like for you to explore um, yeah, I'm pretty dry and dour as people go, and I don't find stuff funny, so this was a stretch for me, I don't know. Um, no, I mean, I, I, I love playing in the world of comedy anyway, and getting to take a, this darker, edgy character with so much pain in her history and, and you know, her own uh, trips back and forth to the netherworld being what they are, um, being able to set her in a more humorous world only gave, for me, a little bit more room to play in her edge and her dryness. Um, but I, I, I really I really do think that many of us love to be able to play in that comedy space and taking a darker character and putting her into a wild environment with greater energy and greater adventure is just a fun challenge. The other thing new about this video game, you can create your own super villain, so when you get your hands on it, what, what are you looking to create? Okay, I'm definitely creating a female supervillain, um, and I'm thinking, uh, I don't know, some, some kind of power where there's not necessarily a freezing, but I feel like something that can stop someone else's action. Okay. And I don't know, I have to check it out. I have to like see what's available. Like a challenge type thing. Yeah, I have to, I have to like see what's available to me, but definitely a female because, you know, I mean... <laughs> Because the female, but I, I, that's one of the things that I love about this game. The idea, look, the Legos to begin with are all about creating anything your imagination desires, right? So I feel like there's something so meta about having Lego games to begin with, because it's where's your imagination going to take you with the thing that tells you to take your imagination wherever you want. Now you can create your own supervillain and let that character be you know, your player throughout the entire, this is your character, you're playing as your character throughout the entire adventure and you've created it. Um, and that's kind of the ultimate Lego adventure. So, I don't know, I think it's great. And do you traditionally play video games when you're involved with them? I do as much as I can. It's really hard to keep up. Um, I know it sounds like a silly answer, but um, when you're lucky enough to be working a lot, it doesn't leave you a lot of time for playing. But I do, um, I make it my business to familiarize myself with um, what pretty much every major developer is working on. I watch cutscenes all the time. I try to stay current with trends and understand um, even artwork and, and um, uh, music choices can help me understand even for an audition or jumping into a game for the first time what this developer's sense is. Um, so I try to do a lot of research, but in terms of getting hooked into a game, there, I, it's, it's hard for me to have time. <laughs>